Leo, hello, hello. Thank you for tuning in to Perfectly Imperfect Tarot. This is Green Eyes here to give you your reading, baby. Yes. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mars, Martians, Astronauts, pick a node. It doesn't matter to me. I love you all and you know it. Cross watchers, I'm a snitch. I'm telling you, okay? Don't curse me in the comments, please. Love you. Guys, this is a judgment-free zone, but you will hear the truth. I thank you in advance. Like, share, subscribe, emails, comments, love tokens, donations. Thank you, thank you, and thank you again. If you haven't subscribed, please do so at this time. I'd love to have you, okay? Make sure you ring the bell so that you're notified of future readings. Leo, I love this energy. I feel so good. Oh, I feel good. Ooh, we, because I think you feel good too. Um, let's start with your animal spirit, the moth. Oh, surrender now, 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 now is the time. Uh, the energy is just right. Timing is just right. Um, submit. You know, go with the flow. It's time. Hummingbird spirit is here. Be here now. Look at that. Under that is the bee spirit. Sweet results await. It's time. It's time. Your time. I love this energy. Okay. Um, I think the animal spirits are telling you, you know, that... Your transformation is uh, was uh, divinely guided, and if you surrender the process uh, to the process, it won't hurt. You know what I'm saying? Um, as bad, it might be a little dis, a little discomfort. That's you know, growing pains, but yeah, the outcome in the end is beautiful. All right, two of water here, center. I love this energy. Uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Um, seeing eye to eye, feeling something to something else, <laughs> but this is like-minded energy. It doesn't have to be a companion. This is like-minded energy. This can be with a friend. This is somebody that gets you. This is you getting somebody. This is you being on the same page. You're fit, able to finish each other's sentences. This is a dual energy. This could be you and divine. Okay. Uh, crowning you is the hero. And the crone, um, I think that the hero is a night of fire energy. I think that uh, some of you may have trouble letting go or, mm, yeah, opening up, okay? The crone is feminine and fearless and powerful um, and wise, you know, uh, protective energy. And you can see the bear um, on this deck here with the hero, protective energy. I think that that's what you're doing with you yourself. You're protecting uh, yourself as well as your spirits, um, uh, guides and ancestors and, you know, God looking after you. Okay. Um, I think it's because of this process. Uh, in the past, you had your eye on the ball. Uh, you have a four of fire here. Um, eye on the ball. Okay, uh, the arrow is ready to be released. The target is in sight. And it seems to me that the target for whatever it was for you brought you to this place of you made you know you made the right choice. Okay. Leading you to uh, a truce. You know, letting bygones be bygones. And I love that because that, that shows growth. You know, swords are down. No more fighting. No more foolishness. Um, agreeing to disagree. You know, let's just move forward. All right. Undermining this energy is the king of air reversed. Now, I have to say. And I don't want to because I don't want to be a, a what is Debbie Downer or pessimistic Patty, whatever you want to call me. But about this King of Air being here and reversed, number one, this is no communication. Uh, number two, this is logical thinking um, in, in the reverse, not thinking logically. 
this is a lot of passion and emotion here i'm not i'm just saying you got fire fire water fire but your uh, thinking is undermining you okay so it could be that maybe you were overthinking and you're just going the uh divine is calling you to go with the flow of your emotions um or you're going with the flow or trying to go with the flow of the emotions but you're not thinking in the process you know what i mean you're emotionally you're letting the emotions control you either way honestly i like the fact that it leads to peace i like the fact that it leads to balance um you're at the bottom of the deck king of fire and with balance six of air here upright and the counselor so you're going to have your peace regardless which means that you know kudos to you congratulations is definitely in order okay uh let's talk about where this began i want to start with this four of fire with your eye on the prize here because that's so determined energy look at this the devil in reverse and judgment ha honey god said no 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 not my leo yes i love it judgment final decision final call i'm breaking free i'm breaking loose i'm getting out of here i got my eye on the prize and i'm going for it kudos to you for that let me get one more uh three of swords reverse honey leo let me just make sure yep and the magician at the bottom of the deck you took every inch of your being and said i am out of here i'm fixing me and you did it look at where you are today tell me about this two of water because this is also balance with a two of wands you took control you're taking control making decisions you see your future ahead of you with the world and the sky is the mother loving limit leo come on now if you coming through here that's how you do it the sky is the mother loving limit. Take on the world. Yes, the world is mine. Come on, Nino. <laughs> yes, world energy is completion. I'm done with the foolishness. I'm done with the games. I'm done with the broken heart. I'm done with that toxic devil energy. I'm done. It's over. I'm taking control. I'm choosing to love and I'm choosing to live. Yes, let me get one on the world. Three of Pentacles reverse. Uh, third party situations, absolutely not. Um, foolishness with work, I will not tolerate. It doesn't matter. You know, Three of Pentacles is in, in, in the upright, you know, could speak to third party or something work related uh, coming together. Leo, you're doing this on your own, okay? You took control of your life and you're doing it. Period. I'm doing it. Tell me about the hero and the crone. And that's that energy up top. That's what you're defending. You are fearless right now. Come on. Sun energy here. Enlightenment. That's your energy. Enlightenment. Happiness. Joy. Whimsical energy. Seeing things for what they are because the light is shining on it. No longer in the dark with the Ten of Cups and the Knight of Pentacles. Leo, I'm not playing with you okay that's what we not gonna do because darn it i need to put some of this happy juice in the bar and and, and sell it okay we make millions leo oh my god bless you honey yes this is how you do it you know that your happiness is coming. You know that your fulfillment is coming. You know that the family is coming together. You know that you're going to have joy everlasting. And you know that even if it's coming in uh, slowly, it's coming in surely. Because the Knight of Pentacles is, is, you know, that's my turtle with hemorrhoids. I ain't going to lie. That's my turtle with hemorrhoids. It's slow. But that's a solid pinnacle, baby. That they got weight to it. That's why the horse moves so slow, even though he ain't even on this damn horse. He walking in front of the horse. That's, look, I'm just saying. <laughs> King of air reverse. Why is the energy undermining Leo? Why is it? Thank you. The wheel. All right, so we got some karma here. Tell me more. Oof. 
Page of Swords reverse. Let me get one on that page only because, yeah. And the Nine of Pentacles reverse. Okay. So, you know, we... Somebody had to deal with some karma. I ain't gonna lie. All right. And Page of Swords reverse, King of Air reverse. Um, definitely a lack of communication. Okay. Um, maybe somebody didn't want to talk about the loss of finances. Or the decrease of finances. Whatever this problem is for you, it's not a problem. It's a temporary situation. And if this is the issue, just discuss it. You know what I mean? It's going to be what it's going to be because you're still moving into a truth. You're moving into balance. You're moving in, you know, even if you don't agree, you know, you're going to reach an understanding. Tell me about that future energy here with the six of fire for Leo. Ten of Wands and the Emperor. See, you're going to take, regardless to, if this is a job-related issue, guys, um, you're going to take control, okay, of, and, and, and to fix it. All right? You're going to say, look, I'm going to work double time. I, I messed up the credit card or, you know, I overdrew the account. I'll fix it. Tell me more. Future energy. Because the emperor um, bosses up and he takes responsibility. Eight of cups here. Um, I have to say it. You know, somebody might choose to walk away. They might not want to hear it, but it doesn't change who you are. You're still the king of the jungle sitting right here at the bottom of the deck, knowing who you are. And by you letting go of foolishness in the past, if this person or this situation, if they don't trust and they're willing to work with you, let them go. Because you still, you know, turn out okay. Nine of Wands here at the bottom of the deck. You know, you still defend your principles. You defend your intentions. You do, you acknowledge the fact that um, regardless of what happened in the past, I know that I owned up to it. I know that I have happiness coming to me. And if it's not with you, then so be it. Let me get one on this Eight of Cups. Because you might know there's better out there for you, Leo. And there's the Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, get the work, baby. Get the work. You know... Two things here. One, somebody messed up some finances. I ain't gonna lie. I have to say that. Alright? Or they messed up pretty bad. Okay? But... They're willing to fix it. They're willing to put the work in. Um, and just move on to bigger and better things, okay? Second thing is some, uh, this is a love situation. Something, somebody messed up and they're not willing to give you a second chance. So... Leo, your way of handling it is just to put your head down and, you know, start working on yourself, you know, working on your future, working on the pursuit of happiness. And I stand by it again. Kudos. Knight of Cups here. You may have a new love coming in. Let me see. No, this is my apologizer. Shoot. Yeah, Leo, you might have a baby. Please, baby, baby, please. I'm sorry. Or oh, this might be you, Leo. We, you know, we can come on now. We're going to keep it decent. <laughs> Guys, this was fun. This was really fun. It was good energy. Um, I encourage you to keep moving forward. You know what I mean? Keep pushing through. Um, if you haven't owned up to what your mistakes were or your person hasn't owned up to it, you know, uh, that's on them or that's on you. 
pick one. It don't matter to me. You know, this is, like I said, you're going to hear the truth. Um, but it seems that what if this is not love related, uh, you at least separated yourself from foolishness, you know, people, places and things. And you're moving in a positive direction, um, taking accountability for uh, right, wrong or indifferences. OK, with an expectation uh, which you should and um, standing on the principles of the promise of joy and happiness. You know what I mean? Um, I love it. I love that. This I love so much that it trumps everything. Like, you understand what I'm saying? Just knowing that tomorrow, you know, the optimism of that tomorrow will be a better day really is pulling you through, you know, and you're defending that and standing on that and protecting that and it's protecting you. And kudos to you for that. All right. It's helping you stay in your power. Um, don't forget that divine is calling you to surrender. So you don't have to be tough with this. You still know who you are. You know, you're the king. This is more of a flow energy. Try to flow with it as best you can. Even if somebody decides to walk away, it's okay. If you're walking away, you'll be okay. If they're walking away, okay, say ra, say ra. All right, guys, I love you. I hope uh, this helps. If it doesn't resonate for you, that's okay. I encourage you to check your moon or rising signs, but don't take the energy with you, please. Leave it here for someone else. Remember, we are all perfectly imperfect, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye.